Hey guys, it's Dan Michaels on Daniel W's account. Today we're playing Just Cause 3, and we're going to show you how to get the fastest boat in the game, which I believe is called the uh, Squeela X7. I think it's called. Yeah, the Squeela X7. And um, helicopter we're going to be using. Um, first things first, you want to have the Erga Horn D. Okay, um, you're going to want two, tier two or three tethers, and uh, you probably want our location, you probably want to have our location unlock, like, take out all the bases and stuff, because it's just much easier with all, all the cops in your way and stuff. So, um, I'm going to head over to the map and show you, I'm going to head over to the map and show you where um, this place is located. And that is, um, right here, not even going to try to pronounce that name, but just read that. It's right, it's right, it's right there, and right there. So if you, uh, if you want to go to the star thing in this lake area, um, so it's like a four-starred star with a thing in the middle. So that's the fastest thing, right there, car in the game, uh, boat in the game, my bad. And so we're, you, what you want to do is you just want to hover over it. All right. <coughs> get the good hover and get out. Um, and tether, like the tier two or three tethers, onto the helicopter. I may have missed. No, I got it. Okay. All right. Just want to restart on that one. I don't think I got a good, a good uh. Hit there. So you pretty much want to use all six up. So I don't know what tier tethers I have. I'm not sure, but I know it's past two, or it's two or above. So it's not one. This is our first time doing it too. So <laughs> we're not really. Look at this. This is the perfect helicopter to do because it's um it's right size. So now what you're gonna want to put your marker into the Atlantic, or I don't know what sea it is, but just in the ocean. And you wanna you're gonna have to bring this all the way over, and it's about two kilometers. So. Yeah, it, it can get hard. Your stuff, sometimes your um, tethers will break. Um, that's why you want strong tethers. It will fall and blow up on the mountainside. So, yeah. You want strong tethers for this. So, yeah, the tethers could break and uh, you'd have to blow yourself up for the boat to respawn. So when you get to the uh, ocean, you're going to want to uh, put a marker on the closest garage on the coast. So you can like, you know the one in Baya has a, uh, it's right on the coast and it has like a garage in the ocean almost where you can put boats. You want to find your closest one of that and put um, a marker on it because once we get to the um, ocean, you um you have to drive to a garage to own the vehicle. Once I get this vehicle or boat, there's only one other vehicle I need. Or it's actually a helicopter, and it's a um, helicopter you unlock in a mission. Like I have the Deer Velo one, where you have to get all the Deer Velo tapes. I have all that. In, okay, so one thing, you don't really want to move your helicopter much. You just want to really go straight at a slow pace. You don't want to go up or down, up or down, anything like that. When you get over the ocean, then that's your time to start going down. Then you drop it. You land your helicopter safely so it doesn't blow up you and your boat. And, uh, yeah, I think we're over the ocean. 
I'm just gonna check on my map real quick. If we are over the ocean. Not quite. We gotta get a tad bit more. Something could go wrong here, folks. Oh, crap. I went too fast there. I just want to slowly bring it down. Don't, like, uh, flip your boat over because that would be bad. There you go. And then just uh, land your thing safely. 